everybody. Hey, everybody. It's Big Daddy. This is a kind of a special live for me right now. What's up, Sarah? How are you? I don't know how many people are going to see this, Sarah, because we're using the old Be Live app. Sarah, hold on. Wait till you hear about this. Uncle Bruno is at the baseball park. He's at the famous Fenway Park. Uh, you know, that's the home of the monster wall, you know. Hey, what's going on, Greg? How are you? Good to see you. Good. We're representing around the country. Minnesota's in the house. Florida's in the house. Cool. This is kind of a big deal for me. But Uncle Bruno said that he might not be able to come live because he has the old app. He doesn't have the old app. So here's a picture he sent me. He's at the park, and he's about to watch the game between the Texas Rangers and – uh, of course, the Boston Red Sox, which I think that's what we're supposed to be doing when we, I think that might be what we're doing when I visit Uncle Bruno later this year. This is the Big Daddy Roadshow. This is just a quick commercial for a company that I started to work for. Well, today, I'm not messing around. Uh, we're going to start selling paper products. Stick around for that. But uh, moving forward through the summer and through the summer uh, cross country road trip, if you guys have any interesting people that I might crisscross with as I go down the East Coast and across the southern states, please make sure you get word to me and uh, to the interesting, cool people. Uh, we have quite a few stops already figured out, but um, if you have something you'd like to have discussed on a future podcast, you know, don't hold back. Send me an email at tom at bigdaddyroadshow.com or bigdaddy at bigdaddyroadshow.com. All right, so here we go. This is, uh, like I said, this is not a typical live. This is just me letting everybody know that because of my spine not hurting as much, I'm going to go out and start sales again. I've been in sales a long time. Let me start selling right now. You guys know about bamboo? Do you guys know about bamboo making paper products? Maybe not. You guys use paper products like toilet paper? Huh? Anybody? Anybody out there use toilet paper? Well, guess what? This toilet paper was made with bamboo. It's a company called Baboo. Baboo toilet paper and paper products. Check it out. All kinds of cool things. Paper towels, toilet paper, hand tissues, hand towels, um, straws. I mean, the list goes on and on. It's made out of bamboo. It's um, hypoallergenic. It's it's a whole bunch of things. It's non-toxic. It's really good for taking makeup off, ladies. It's durable. Well, that's kind of like bamboo strong. That's what my new kitchen floor is uh, made out of, bamboo. So interesting. We can make flooring out of it. And I got to tell you, this bamboo flooring I put in is phenomenal. I'm not selling that, though. I'm selling this. I'm selling paper products from a company called Baboo. And if anybody out here watching knows anybody in the supermarket industry or veterans hospital where they buy paper products, I really need you guys to hook Big Daddy up because a portion of my income is going to go to my veterans at the Hazel and Elks. Just like everything else, I told you, I need to work. We need to make money. We've been doing this show a long time, but this is about to hit American store shelves. And I already went out today and talked to two companies, two big ones. One is called Wise. And one is called Giant, Giant Supermarkets and Weiss Supermarkets were the first two places that I went to to show this product. Bamboo is really interesting. Turns out they don't need to bleach it. You know, when it's done, when they make it into a pulp, it comes out looking like this color. And it's a really attractive color. It feels, no, it does not hurt to use. That's a very good question, Sarah. Sarah says, does it hurt to use? No, that's the best part. It doesn't hurt to use. It's really soft. Also, when you blow your nose with the, the old-fashioned paper, uh, tissue papers and whatnot, you know how your nose gets red, Sarah? This doesn't do that. You know what makes your nose red mostly? Apparently, it's the bleach they use to keep the toilet paper white. Okay? But no, honestly, this is very soft. For toilet paper, also, three-ply. Three-ply, it's stronger than most. And I'm telling you right now, you can bundle this up. I don't even want, you want to know how I use, this is ridiculous, I'm showing you this live, but this is what I do when I do toilet paper, okay, and I use the white stuff, well, I did until now, but I just keep wrapping, this is serious business when you're in, in a, you know, in a john, but this toilet paper, 
I'm told you don't need to use as much. Here's the deal. I'm probably going to use the same amount, but regardless, three ply, it's not, it's not what you're thinking. It's soft. The hand tissue, even softer. But, um, so yeah, don't sweat that, Sarah. Whew. Keep it positive, Sarah. Yeah, they sell all kinds of things. Hand tissues. They sell, um, like I said, hand towels. There's new products going to be coming down the pike, but straws, you know how some of the states are having uh, banning straws, plastic straws? Well, well, this picture actually was straws. I don't know if I told you that. It looks like bamboo, and they come in different colors, and it's really cool. So, yeah. So this is me announcing the fact that I am I was out today selling, and it felt so cool because it's such an easy product. The people were really digging it. I met girls. I met girls in the parking lot, and we were just talking about it, and I asked them to, to hold it and feel it and rub it, and they rubbed the tissues on their face. It's, it's really good for taking makeup off, ladies. It's really good for that. Um, anyway, everybody was loving it. So we're hoping that the corporate people at uh, Weiss and Giant think the same. We do think they will. This really is a cool product. I want to publicly thank my friend Paul Rutenberg for uh, the opportunity. And I just want to be the first person to go live, at least on a podcast, to show everybody these cool products. This is like a little hand. This is like a little pack of hand tissues like you take in the car. You would open this up and there's multiple packs in here. And you could, uh, I don't want to open it up because it's my sample for selling. But I have tons more coming, more samples coming, more stores to go visit. So if you want to be one of the first ones to put this on your store shelves and you happen to catch this video, contact me at Tom at BigDaddyRoadShow.com until I get my email at Babu. Babu Paper Products. This is really cool. This is really cool. So apparently Uncle Bruno can't make it to the show. Uh, he's at Fenway Park tonight, the lucky bum. The famous Fenway Park, home of the world champion Red Sox. I'm sure he'd be loving to be up on screen. So here, I'm going to put him up on screen just so everybody can see Uncle Bruno. That's probably what he looks like sitting in the ball field right now. Got a big cigar in his mouth, probably all cocky talking to some Ranger fans, telling them how they won all those championship rings. So Uncle Bruno at Fenway Park can't get live with Big Daddy. He was going to. He wanted to, but he couldn't do it. He's versus uh, Texas Rangers tonight. So good luck, Uncle Bruno, with that. And uh, that's pretty much all I got to say. I wanted this to be short and sweet. Let everybody know that I'm getting back to work. I'm trying to get back on my feet. Um, I'm grateful to God for getting out of bed. And uh, no, I'm not a complete Jesus freak or anything, but I'm telling you, uh, I'm back walking with zero pain. On most days, I had a little bit of pain the last two days, but nothing, nothing close to what I'm used to. Like, I'm talking debilitating pain I had. I'm about to go down uh, to see Ryan la last night at the campfire down at the campsite. And we are still working uh, in, in great detail on this cross-country trip for the Big Daddy Roadshow, where we're going to support our Elks Lodges around the country and uh, hopefully raise awareness for veterans with PTSDs and uh, children with issues like, um, you know, health issues like cancer and autism and things like that. So I'm taking this very seriously. I'm thrilled to be able to get back to work with a really cool product. If you're looking for some paper towels and your store doesn't have them, tell them to look into this all bamboo made product. It's really cool. I'm not kidding you. This is a really cool product. This saves like hundreds of, like a couple, I don't know if it's something like 900,000 acres of trees a year are cut down for the regular papers. Not with this, not with this, not with this. This is a product called Babu. And I'm really grateful to have an opportunity to, I mean, I'm like, I have something here to sell that's never been sold ever. This is how my friend packaged the product for American sales. Isn't Paul talented? Look how nice. See how nice the color is? That's the way it comes out when it's done. They don't dye it. There's no chemicals in it. It's really good for you. This is, this is really good. Good stuff. High quality. So that's it. That's all I got to say. Also, I'm going to put a picture of myself up looking stupid. Somebody made one of my fans. There's a stupid picture of me with hair. What? It's crazy. All right. Good luck, Uncle Bruno. Hope you win that game tonight against the Texas Rangers. 
we also have a lot of fans from Texas. So shout out to you guys if you guys win. I'm a Phillies fan. So I'm like, the outcome of this game is, I have no, I could care less. It doesn't bother me. Either way. This is the Big Daddy Road Show. We need to start selling paper, people. So once again, if you know anybody in the, in the supermarket industry or anybody that buys a lot of paper products, I need you to get them with me so I can show them this really cool, really cool product. And hopefully someday you'll be uh, wiping your bum with Big Daddy's paper. Wouldn't that be cool? Hey, what are you doing? I'm wiping my bum with Big Daddy's paper. Cool. All right. So God bless America. I won this the other day along with a really cool piece of crystal supporting the – the Sophie Cox house, which is part of our tour coming down the East coast from uncle Bruno in New Hampshire. And, uh, like I said, that's all coming together. We're talking about buying the van this week. We're going to go live negotiating the haggle and the price for this old van. Remember the van is a character on the show. Will it make it across America? Can she do it? The van is meant to be old school like this show. The van is a character. On this show, if you donate money to my Hazel Nilks number 200, you'll get to put your, your ideas for what we'll name the van. I'm thinking something like Millennial Falcon. She's old, but she's sturdy, and the owner says it's going to make it across country. This van will be a crisscross between Cheech and Chong, Scooby-Doo, and Bad News Bears breaking training, because we do love baseball. So if anybody remembers that movie, Bad News Bears, Walter Matthau, remember Tatum O'Neill? Anybody? No? <clears throat> All right. One last plug for this new product. Whoops. Babu. You heard it here first on the Big Daddy Road Show. This is Big Daddy. We are out of here. I got to go. I got to go sit by a campfire with uh, Ryan, my co-host, and Audrey, and the kids. Do good out there, people. Let's go some. Let's save some trees with this product. Ask your grocer to get in touch with us. Let's get this hanging on your shelves. All kinds of cool things. Straws, paper towels, hand towels, tissues, toilet paper. It's really cool. Thanks for watching the Big Daddy Road Show. I told you exciting things were going to come. Keep up the good work, everybody. And uh, just wait until we show you what we're going to be doing with this stuff. Bamboo. It's pretty cool. All right, time to hit the nature trail. I'm going to hang out by the fire with Ryan one last night at the campgrounds. This is Big Daddy. This is my special announcement. I'm selling papers. Who wants to buy some paper? Thanks for watching. And if you haven't yet, visit my website, BigDaddyRoadshow.com. That's BigDaddyRoadshow.com. If you're serving in the military, I never served, but I just saluted you. I don't even know if that's proper. Can I do that? I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't do that. But, you know, the show always supports our military and the U.S. flag. So, which is why I have this picture of a flag hanging in my fireplace in the backyard. Yeah. Babu is for you. I like that, Greg. Really cool. And uh, like I said, if you have any friends in different states, I have, I have the availability to sell this in all 50 states. Pretty cool, right? I'm telling you, if I get this on store shelves, I can make a lot of good, a lot of good with this money. So let me show you. Let me show you what we could do. Help me out. And, uh, Say a prayer for Uncle Bruno's Red Sox tonight. God knows we don't want him cranky. Oh, one last thing he told me to mention. I was He was going to mention it himself. The Bruins, the hockey game, the big game tomorrow night. It's for the, for the whole thing. It's for the Stanley Cup, right? Is that what they win, the Stanley Cup? I'm not really big into hockey. I can't see that puck moving around. Anyway, that's it. This is Big Daddy. I'm going to sit by a campfire, and I hope you'll share this show. Appreciate it. And thanks, Greg, for that. That's pretty cool. See, it's very simple to spell. Babu, paper products. I'm a salesman. I'm a rep. You might see me in a store pipping this stuff, showing the people the products. Let me tell you something. The girls, the girls today that touched this product and stuff were like, Big Daddy, this is really cool. It really is. Yeah, buy it and try it. Can't go wrong. I'm telling you. I said, wow. Greg, you must be in sales. Actually, Greg is in sales down in Florida. Greg, you can tell, you can put a link to what you sell down there if you want. Okay, I got to go. Seriously, thank you for your time. Appreciate it. Things are looking up. Keep the prayers coming. I love them. I'm praying for you. Stay positive and uh, do good out there. 
And if I criss- crisscross your state, come out and say hello and help me raise money for my veterans and kids through my Elks Lodge, Elks Lodge number 200, which I'm a past president of. I take the flag and my Elks Lodge very seriously. Thanks, Greg. Appreciate it. Fenway Park, Uncle Bruno. What's it called? The Monster Wall? I wonder if I could hit the ball over the Monster Wall. I don't think so. Stay positive, everybody. This is the Big Daddy Road Show. We're coming in the next couple. Well, it's probably about a month away. We got to get this van. We got to get it all tricked out. Looking cool. Hanging trinkets to sell to raise money for veterans and kids. What's that thing called? The Green Monster? Ugh, so intimidating. Almost Home Furniture. Put the link in down below. Okay, Greg, you've been a longtime supporter of the Big Daddy Road Show. I appreciate that. All right, stay positive. I I just want to put this graphic up. I'm out of here. Appreciate it. Alexa, replay song. Let's see if we get banned for this. Stop. One more, one last plug. Babu. Babu. Remember, you heard it here first. This is the first live broadcast, guaranteed podcast, to showing off this product, and it's all new. Ain't nobody got something like this, but we do, and we think you're going to love it. Have a great day, everybody. This is Big Daddy. I'm out.